Hey guys, it is Ian Will here, and today we'll be looking at 150 days. I just wanted to start off by saying the update is very good, and I've enjoyed um, experiments that I've done on it thus far. I figured out you know hammer and gun, but claw and scythe is a bit of a mystery to me. I'm still trying to figure out how to incorporate that into my farming it's made the game a bit more active instead of idle I'd say because now you have to think more which is I guess a good thing and a bad thing in that it's good that now there's a use for every weapon but it's kind of difficult as uh, some people don't have a lot of time to play the game and now yeah, there's more to do online, which makes it a bit harder. You kind of got to choose what you want to gain. Um, but apart from that, just standard thing. Let's just get into the stats. So we've done claw for the past how many videos? We're gonna keep on doing claw. However, I will show ham as well since now that's the main um, weapon for pushing bosses. Let's see how we do in that. So there the stats. Let's see what hammer is looking like. Um, there it is for hammer. I say skills for bosses, just like with claw. I use the beast, spirit, madness, outrage, and poison cloud for stage bosses. And for normal bosses, I just use haste. That doesn't change, it's the same if you use Annihilation, then use Annihilation. If you use Unholy, use Unholy. Um, for the other bosses like Geg or Gora and uh, the Old Lord bosses too, uh, whatever gives you the most damage. Um, with the diamonds, I got before post update. I wanted to max out magic tools, which that, that finally looks nice to have all 100 there. Uh, I switched my runes from claw to hammer, obviously, to push bosses. Max stage is currently 730 ish, 730 right, right now. What else is there? Oh, trials. got level 3 on the claw beforehand I'm gonna go to level 4 and then I gotta think about what I want to do with the putting on hammer or going with claw or even going on the wing as well for the skill 4 damage it's really it's interesting I'm gonna have to give that some more thought I'm not sure what to say there mm. let's look at infamy infamy is still no like I put 600k on it i got to level six makes me cry actually i still don't have anything good i can always i didn't expect anything from that it's quite sad but mm. i'm not sure what else there is to show um, oh yes so I got DS to 100, and then I got attack boost to 80. I want to put more into crit, instant strike, and skill damage, and then focus on getting ES and soul up. I want to get ES to 200 to 150-ish, and just keep it there, and, and eventually max out. I want this to be the first bit to max out. Because yes, is always something that we are gonna gonna need for a while, anyways. And EXP, I want to get that up a little bit too. I think that is everything. So let's challenge the boss. If I can find it. I just start out 
and then as soon as they come, I just disable all the skills except four and six, and just keep it running. And I hope I might have enough time. Yeah, definitely will. Might even be able to do it again. But yeah, the update last last far. I've enjoyed it a lot. Hope everyone is uh, uh, and enjoying it as much as I am. I think we'll still be in a state of stasis for about maybe a week or so. To everyone, you know, figures out how to how to do things, how to get the benefit from it. Um, but yeah, apart from that, it's great. It's okay. Isn't isn't too bad. One could say, I wish I didn't have to activate all of my skills. It would have been a lot easier. Yeah, but it's all right. It's what it's what it's what yeah. I might be able to push maybe three or four stages. Well, I'll leave it at that. I want to say thank you uh, very much for watching. I want you to comment below what your thoughts on the Yoki are. Good, bad. Could it could, could it be better? Um, if anyone's had any good luck on in infamy, let me know and uh, please send some luck my way. But apart from that, I say thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye.